Good day. I'm Clive and welcome to CDP Outdoors. Just leaving Helena Shelter and we're heading to the Wallach Shelter on the Bibbleman Track. Now if you can see it, a uh, little dot on the hill is Hewitt Shelter all the way over there and that's where we started about 15 minutes ago although it was, it was a fairly sleep, uh, sleep, fairly steep decline coming down, down, down rocky, washed out, pea gravel, slippery poles definitely needed, I went on my arse nearly twice again and brings you down to the bottom of this hill and now and all the way back up. Up, 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 and around there. So it is a bit of a hard slog. Just had difficulty coming down that steep slope. And then this hill, it's, this hill here is not so steep, it's just continuous, but after doing the decline, you can feel it on this one. But as you can see, we're basically to the top of this hill. And I've got both poles. I think I'm going to have to soften about half hour and take this jacket off because it's getting warm very quick. Right, I'll see you shortly. First hour, been a bit awkward, difficult. My actual pace has dropped to 2.5 kilometers per hour. It's basically scrambling a lot over rocks uh, and washed out tracks. Stepping over one side to get to a level bit, then back over the other side to get to another level bit. Still nice out here, it's beautiful still. Uh, yeah, look. I'm at uh, 2.5, so I've got 6.5 kilometres to go until I'm at Worley. Yeah, definitely bring your walking poles. Definitely. Right, I'll carry on walking. Two hours in and I made it to the White Bridge. Uh, 
So we've got about 4.2 kilometers to go. That last hour, the inclines and the declines, and they're a bugger. What are you loose pea gravel underneath your feet? <sighs> Be very careful when you're doing this section. I can't remember it being this bad before. Uh, and the hill, my goodness, I forgot all about that. I didn't even know if it, it existed or not. It took me over half an hour to make it up to the top, just taking my time. Stopped twice on the way. I had to sit down to uh, one, one fallen tree and then a log further up. So be prepared to slow down and take a lot of breaks. Now I've got to go all the way up there and take a right and carry on up and over. Three hours in and 2.5 kilometers to go. I just want a flat bit for now, but I do know not far up there. There's a drop down and then drop back up the other side to get to the shelter. Well, one foot in front of the other, let's keep going. We go four hours and the shelter's about 50 meters that way. I'm going to look forward to sitting down after all those hills. I was thinking about going on to the next shelter too but I think after that I'm going to seriously think twice about it. So I hope you've enjoyed the video and if you have please go down below and click on the subscribe button. The notification bell next to it and select all so you can be notified of all future videos click the thumbs up button and if you are already a subscriber again I thank you very much so until next time get out there have some fun and take care